Herbert Sutcliffe was uh, Jack Hobbs' partner and that wonderful opening partnership for England went on for such a long time. It's not often in Test cricket history that two great openers come along at the same time, but to add to Jack Hobbs, England had Herbert Sutcliffe. Sutcliffe was a Yorkshireman, very precise, very neat in appearance. In these commercial days, Herbert Sutcliffe probably would have made a lot of money in advertisements because he had this smooth hair. I'm not sure what he put on it, but it was a bit like Compton's Brill Cream in the 40s. He took part in the world record opening partnership of 555 with Percy Holmes for Yorkshire against Essex, 1932. Herbert Sutcliffe did have an amazing record. In fact, he played slightly fewer test matches than Jack. I think Herbert Sutcliffe played, what, something like 55 test matches. But he averaged just over 60 per innings, and Jack Hobbs was about four runs less per innings. And of course, one of the great features of the two of them together was they were wonderful players on really tricky, sticky wickets. And there was a one extraordinary test match in Melbourne on an absolute pig of a sticky wicket when they won the test match for England in the second innings when everyone thought England would be out for a, under 100. Uh, Hobbs and Sutcliffe put on well over 100 and England went on to win. An extraordinary performance. Together, they're probably the greatest opening partnership the game has known. Sutcliffe remains one of the highest scoring opening batsmen in test history. He was cool and calm, he hooked, he would look at the bowler almost with disdain, never impatient, you're never in a hurry, but goodness me, did the runs pile up, he's right up there in the highest run scorers of all.